probably the time to see the show. So four works we were changed or made for Palazzo Grassi and for Venice. Obviously the Doug Willer behind you, <laughs> uh, which took a year and a half. He came, he had different ideas to react with the, the light of Venice and his project. Um, Yang Vo, the room with the, where he erased the walls of Palazzo Grassi and made the curtain which is on the river. The Latifa Eshkash, where she installed the stencil for revolution specifically for here. And the baby of the exhibition who's there if you need to meet her. <coughs> Claire Tabouret, who made a work, she's always working about like in her paintings. But this is an echo to the Paolo Uccello painting, which is in front of Firenze, the Batania. <coughs> in general, the show, uh, I pushed the, the theme of light, also with the philosophical or individual meaning, so to play from what we fear, which is light against black, light against death. Well, that's why there is also obviously uh, Marcel Brotter, Sam Gilbert and George. But there's also some black which can give light. So this is a toy one touch uh, to show you things that you usually don't see, but on the black and making a distance with what can be seen with light means the photographs. So that's also a play with the Yervin Bain, Bain, of course. Um, the, all the works, if you want, I can make a quick tour of each of the artists which can give you inside. But all the works and all the installation were done with the artists. They're always involved in the exhibition as well as of the photographs and catalogs. Uh, the rhythm is also made with a hope and fear in a way. If we go through, uh, so you have that big work by Doug. Uh, then you have that uh, Marquise by Philippe Pareno, which makes you in doubts with whatever spectacle you're going to see. I love the way it plays also with the rules of the Palazzo Grazi, where you see all those old owners and what they were looking at and how you see them. And that very delicate rainbow uh, by Lydia Gastaldon, she's coming from Switzerland, uh, which is made with hand uh, with just wool and it's the first one with a representation of light instead of being the light itself uh, but also generous and I hope the show is generous for everyone because everyone smiles when you see a rainbow so it's a way to get you in a, in a mood even if the work after is the death with Marcel Motors. Uh, there's different period uh, shown like Julio um, Le Parc, it's from the cinetic art um, that infant, infinite light moving all the time, and also made with nearly nothing, very simple. Uh, the inside light to change the point of view on your own history, so you change the subject which is lighted in your own history, is uh, uh, token by the Ejaliza Atila work, which is how you can change the way you see reality on the episode of a psychotic person. The, the use of the energy uh, with Anthony Mutadas who compared the lights, uh, the candle with the lights, so it speaks of different uh, relationship we can have with light uh, in between the past and the present, the rich and the poor, which is an echo with the, the Robert Whitman, there's that bulb, the light change, and there is some oil coming down, uh, so it's more intimate because it remembers you a shower, so the shower is how we use the energy. It's placed just after the David Clermo, which is that quite fascinating video that he took an extract from the uh, internet with those black people working in an oil company in Nigeria, but under the water, and you don't know anymore what's, this is all the energy, but uh, what's more important, if it's the water or the oil, uh, as well as the the play on the art history when the American took over the power and the black painting by Stella was one of the, the big uh, person. So Hélène Sturteven that you know, she was shown at the Elodio del Tokyo, uh, speak about re-giving that to everyone, not making it unique. And Bertrand Lavier, who's a fan artist with the Neon, put uh, him in danger and speak about the power of the distance with the critic, 
the Bobby Irwin, you can change the position. He comes from the same period and movement than Doug Willer behind. So it's back in space and light in California. Uh, the white paintings, but general idea, it's an echo with the Dan Go in the front. Uh, the white makes you blind, uh, and it's about AIDS. Uh, they took the logo of uh, Love by Robert Indiana that everyone sees, and it's a white AIDS written on white, so the white can uh, make you blind, uh, and you finish with the clair tabouret at the end uh, with the, the echo with the Renaissance. As Mathieu just arrived, I'm at your disposal <laughs> to be a bit deeper on each of the, the artists or whatever. And then you can meet Kira Paxin and Mathieu who took care of the main venture. Thank you. So much.